Hoon Na. Main Hoon Na. I must say, it's not only lovely because there's no work for anybody in TV and film here right now. <laughs> Except but, for me. I'm a scab. But <laughs> the process, it, I so wish TV and film processed the whole breakdown, submission, and audition process the way they do with theater. Because with theater, if you're a member of Actors' Equity, the breakdowns all show up on Actors' Equity's site two weeks in advance. Mm -hmm. You have a sign-up date. The minute it opens, you can sign up for the audition. Full breakdowns, full everything. And it's it's and obviously it's theater, which is I adore. So it's just it's been so wonderful to have this nonstop flow. And it's in person auditions and callbacks. Everything is in front of everybody. I, I said to one casting director in a in a callback, I said it is so beautiful to have face to face and interactive creativity and focusing on art. And he said, Isn't that the way it's supposed to be? I said, Yes, it is. Just Hey, welcome back to the Stupid Directs of Corbin. Thank you for letting me just go off on that. Gross. And you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you to everybody's posts on Patreon. Follow us for your Twitter account. Subscribe to the like button. Today we got a, uh, this is a little snippet from um, Madness in the Desert, which is the. Oh, yes. Which is the two hour documentary on Lagan. Uh, so this is actually audition tapes cricketers for Lagan. So this is a little okay. snippet from it. Audition tapes of the cricketers yeah. for Lagan. Yeah. So they go into little okay. depth of the, some of the casting. Oh, I can't wait. The... It's going to be so fun to watch. This. I've wanted to watch the Madness in the Desert for a while. Um, I would like to because I don't. I don't think no. Steph did watch it with me. This is one she did watch with me. Okay. Uh, but I would like to watch it again because it was such a good movie. But it's three and a half hours, right? <laughs> I think it's more than that. I think, it? it's, I think it's just over four, four yeah. Uh, but the, the documentary itself is over two. <laughs> yeah. Not a surprise. <laughs> it's just very funny. Yeah. A lot of people told us to watch it. But anyways, uh, just get a little glimpse here of, um, of, of what it's about. Is that written in pencil? Oh, it was in the 90s. So. Yeah, that's great. We only did stuff in pencil in the 90s. Pre-production is now in full swing, and we are in the midst of frenzied activity. So go and go. In India, screen, uh, you know, having screen tests is very unusual and looked down upon, and actors feel insulted if they are asked to test for a film. He's been around for a long time, that guy. And it's a process which really clears your mind as a director. Heck yes. You have to screen test. When an actor tests in front of the camera, you come to know whether he is, you know, close to the character you want or not. Mm -hmm. And the chemistry. <laughs> Did she? Who who gave her the choreography, or did she just come up with it? Oh, I'm sure it was. I'm sure she probably was given it. I'm I'm get I'm thinking. Oh, the white lady. Sing it. Oh, yes. She auditioned. She's lip syncing. Oh, that's definitely Julie Andrews. Well, gotta show your lip syncing skills. Yeah. You know, one of the difficult aspects of the casting was the British casting. Uh. Have you made any other films? No, this is our first film. Why do you think you're here? To play gay. Is the film in English? No, the film is in Hindi. I've seen my car, but it's You mean you want British actors for an Indian film which is to be made in Hindi for an Indian audience and not for an international audience? So, I mean, what? But the moment they read the script, you know, they used to suddenly look at us from a different point of view. Oh, yeah, I want to watch the whole Bummer. thing. Bummer! I want to watch the whole thing now. Yeah. <laughs> that's, oh. that's what I was hoping. I was like, I would hope I would. I think I, think I remember hearing 
something about screen testing being an insult once before somewhere, maybe with a coffee with Quran. Yeah, I, I mean, not that it, I I understand. I it, not that I agree with it, but I understand from like big stars why they would be insulted. I wouldn't be insulted, but like since these people are like, why would you want me to audition? Blah, 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 blah. It's happened here, too. It's not just India, though. No, I know, like, but for those that it happens to, that's just ego. Yeah, it is. 100%. Yeah. 100%. That's what it is. It's like, my word, I've heard so many stories of Oscar-winning legends yeah. thankful for the opportunity to screen test for some films. Yeah. It's just but it's, such, it's so common. Are like, they think they're like, why, why the hell would I audition? Why the hell would I audition? Yeah. I'm the reason people are going to go see your film. Yeah, not not if you're not right for the role. Yeah, no. <laughs> Wild. Yeah, right? Yeah. Um, but yeah, it, it, I already wanted to watch it, but it makes me very intrigued to, it, to, it, to watch it. It also speaks volumes into the the mindset behind... It's something that Raj and DK said in our interview of them that is really important. Dose that, on dosts. That, that it... it it matters when they when they have a creative team together. It really matters that the I I think it was when I asked them the question, "What's one of the things you dislike the most?" They said it's when we when we have to tr when actors are giving us advice about things that doesn't fall in alignment with what we want to do. Yeah, because an actor's job is to serve the text mm -hmm. and come into alignment with the director's vision. You should absolutely collaborate. There's many times a director will hear an idea and think that was great. Let's do that. But ultimately, you submit to whatever the director's wanting. To do, and that includes in the audition process. If they ask you to do a screen test, you do a screen test. If they ask you to do a chemistry read, you do a chemistry read. It's just you're there to serve the project. If screen tests aren't as prevalent as they used to be, though. Um, maybe not for um, like the leads of films, obviously. Though they're probably still doing that. It's definitely a hundred percent happening for new people playing new roles. Yeah. So, like when they're looking for the new Bond, when they're looking for the new Superman, when they're looking for the new you fill in the blank. You're gonna screen test, and yeah. it's gonna be a months long it's process. An, it's, but, an, it's an important. But like I mentioned, Sally Field, she has a beautiful story. I've mentioned a little bit of it here, where she had to screen test to play uh, Mary in Lincoln for for Spielberg and and uh, Daniel De Lewis, and that's an Oscar winning legend who was just so happy to be doing the process with them. Imagine so, asking Sally Fields to. I know. Because <laughs> he's Steven Spielberg, so it's like he, he can. can whatever he wants, obviously, he can. right? Uh, but, like, but I think even uh, from what I know of her, I think if you asked that of Meryl Streep, she, without hesitation, she would screen test for you. I wonder what that conversation's like. Is it just like, we would like you to screen test? And are they like, okay. I'm sure it's prefaced with... I'm really sorry to ask you this. We want you. Yes. But the producers. But, the, but, but we just need to see if it works. And they're like, Steven Spielberg, you are the producer. What right. are you talking about? <laughs> I'm sure I'm sure anytime a legend is asked a screen test, it's prefaced Personally, with, I'm sorry to ask uh, uh, Sally Fields to audition, uh, to a <laughs> screen test. Oh, no. Because I'd be like, you're fine. I'm, yeah, <laughs> I'm thankful that you can be in my film. But when you're Steven Spielberg. I would never ask Or her. Christopher Nolan. Because I'm sure. like. Yeah, you're gonna knock yeah. it out of the park. <laughs> so, <laughs> so different actors. I'm just maybe. grateful to have you. Yeah, different actors maybe, but Sally Fields. When I'm like, yeah, no. I so don't. I want to. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah want to watch this. Uh, let us know if it's one that we should watch. Is it worth watching? Or should we just watch it? Uh, I don't know, because uh, it is a documentary. Yeah, let us know. So uh, let us know down below. Just. <laughs>